Okay, so this is a Minecraft adventure that I want to start playing. Um, recording on YouTube. We'll see how long it goes. So if you like the video, please press the like button. Um, and that will encourage me to record more of these. This is my base. I've got a glass bridge there, which I'll show you later. A bit of a basement, which I've just built recently, and I'll just show you the main entrance actually. I just lit all this up recently. Torches everywhere. I recorded a video just earlier, but the lag was terrible, so I've tried to fix a few things. Hopefully, it won't be lagging in this video. There's my main base. I've got flatstone now. I'm thinking possibly convert all this rest to flatstone as well. Um, at the moment most of the cobblestone is walls and I've got flat stone from the floors. This is just my fast transport system back to the bottom. I'll show you that later when I need to go down to the bottom. So the second floor I can easily get. I jump down this hole and I'll land on the glass and be there. Or I jump down, well it's lagging a bit still. Jump down this hole and I go all the way down the bottom. And I use minecart tracks to get back up fast because that's only a one way down. Oh yep, yeah. cactus farm. I'll go there in a second. This is the... I built my base, I hollowed out a mountain, the same square blocks of how much I wanted to build my base, um, and then built up, and this was the original top part of the mountain, so that's why I've just left this here. Um, just as a sort of reminder, because I'd, I decided when I first started this world that I didn't really want to wreck the landscape that much, um, so I've tried to build things on top of the landscape. That melts a main difference where I've actually uh, terraformed most of that to make it work. But the rest is pretty much all natural with me trying to build things inside the mountain or that kind of thing. Whoa. Okay, yeah, so I was always walking on the edge and nearly hurting myself there, so I ended up just recently adding a bit of a boardwalk, a wooden boardwalk around here, which makes it easier to get across uh, without injuring myself from cacti. So I have that's a glass cap I have. Thought I might hurt me. Um so if I have my bow now this is I made that as like a targeting range. I've got the lights there so it's lit up at night and I can still use it at night. And quite often there'll be cows walking across there. There's none at the moment. There's usually cows and pigs and sheep and everything walking along there so I can just shoot them from this distance and practice my aiming. Uh, it's a lighthouse up there and it's a kind of wooden building with no real purpose. I'll go downstairs and I'll go this way. See, I, really seem to, I need to find a way of doing that without hurting myself or find just or you just use the stairs. So this is the main room with all the stuff in it. I'll just go to the basement quickly. I've got cobblestone and and um, cobblestone and dirt and just random items and redstone. Uh, wool and dyes, sand and glass, uh, railway stuff, uh, weapons and suit of armor. Spare suit of armor. I've already got an iron set on. It's my incinerator. Alright, so I'll go downstairs now. This is something I recently built, and it's got a little window. I can hear a cow making weird noises. Okay, there's all my raw food. I've got a huge stockpile, and I cooked food. I can't be bothered cooking it, <laughs> except for the parts in my inventory. It's basically the only amount I've cooked. I've got my diamond pickaxe when I'm mining obsidian. A few other things. Uh, farm supplies for growing stuff. glass walkway used, used to be just glass on the ground but then I enclosed the whole side and the roof was glass as well. Um, I'm not sure about it, it's kind of a good effect but it's maybe I might need to make it one block higher because it feels a little bit claustrophobic to me. This is a, um, the whole purpose of that glass walkway was to, come on down the ladder, was to go to this mining area. 
um, which I haven't actually got around to mining out yet. There's enemies there. So I'll get around to that at some point. And explore the area. This is that I found a natural cave, I think it was, if I remember correctly, sticking out at the top, so I made a way to easily get there during the night to walk there through this special glass bridge. Just any excuse to make a glass bridge, basically. Okay. It's getting nearly night time. I think is that sunrise or sunset? Can't tell. I think it's sun's going down. Oh, and if I have a quick sleep, see if that works. Alright, oh, there you go. Nice view of the moon from here. Yeah, the moon's definitely coming up. I'll sleep. It'll take about five seconds. Okay. Very quick tour of the rest of this area. I'll show you the one car tracks a minute. Infinite source of water. Incinerator, like I said, you can see the incinerator through there. One little bridge, a little sort of half milk, only goes around to this front part of the building. Uh, there's a YouTube user called Fatal Saint, I think his numbers are 83, Fatal Saint 83, which has a lot of YouTube videos. Um, and I got this walkway from him, basically, he has wooden planks on the outside and half steps in the middle and it just looks so awesome that I had to copy it. Um, so that's, that, this wasn't my idea, I just copied that off of him. A uh, useless wooden house that I built earlier today, so it's just a wooden, the first wooden house I've built, basically everything I usually built is out of stone because I'm paranoid about the stuff burning down. And um, I haven't really got a use of it for it yet, so maybe if anyone watching this video could give me some ideas about what I can use this for I've got way too many mines already so just making it into an entrance to a mine is kind of pointless maybe there's something else, maybe I could build a tower on top or something, I'm not sure yes, a useless wooden house at the moment I'm coming down this walkway a bit, this is oh there's a hole there, I didn't know that hmm. um, Looks like another cave there. Actually, no, I know what that is for. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, this sort of reminds me of a cop. I hear footsteps. There's no creepers or something, is there? Uh, this is like a Colosseum, sort of half Colosseum, naturally, so I'm thinking maybe I could build something in there, but I'm not really sure what yet. Some sort of curved steps thing leading down to some central, I don't know what. I'll decide that later, or maybe, like I said, maybe someone watching the video would come up with some suggestions, let me know what you think I should put down there. Sealed Cave of Doom. Clear entrance sealed, do not enter. Well, I'm going to enter anyway. And this is basically lava for effect and a nether portal, which I haven't entered yet. I've just built it and just so when I want to go into the nether I can, but kind of afraid of getting stuck there, so I want to make sure I'm fully prepared before I finally go in there. A lighthouse. So when I do go to the nether, I want to turn... Oops, can't see in there. That's just a temporary bed while I was building around here. I want to turn all of these candles into nether rock and set it alight uh, because I think that would look a lot better at night but at the moment I've just got candles and when I go to the nether then I can replace them because from a distance you can't really see the candles that well it's just like little tiny specks of light and I'm thinking nether rock you'll be able to see a lot better and this music is really annoying me at the moment Oops. Turned it back up again. That's better. Okay, to the beach. Which I haven't really done anything with yet. This cobblestone shoulder, which I've called the bulk shed, looks a bit ugly to me, so I'm thinking maybe I can replace that with wood, seeing as I've started building things with wood now. 
um, and put a chest in there with some spare bolts and turn this into a bit of a dock. Uh, put some cloth there so if the bolt runs into it, it doesn't get damaged and fall to pieces. Alright, there's sandstone half steps here. So oh, I've already started to use half steps a lot lately. Now I'll just quickly show you my minecart track, which is pretty simple, but if we go back home, I have these more sign to the beach, which I just showed you. See the lava. Uh incinerate a thing from here. Now my quick way down is if it will let me down, we'll get and to get back up again. Oh that's my little forest that I planted, so if I ever need wood I can go down there. Let's get back up again. Oh don't mind cup me. I think I've got spares. Mine cuts, yep. Let's see, oh, I'll place dirt. So that's just then, I get slightly injured actually. I'll move that. That's just a booster to get me started. So basically, you know, takes me back up to the top of my base, right to the entrance. Pretty simple. It uses two boosters, the one that I showed you at the start and there's one right here to oops, get me up this final slope as well. So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed my little tour of my place, uh, my little slice of Minecraft. Um, if you want more videos, let me know. Press the like button if you like this video. And I'll hopefully get around to making another one very soon, possibly going into the nether for the first time. Okay, thanks for watching.